People living in a Pinellas County neighborhood have seen enough car accidents. They want a traffic signal put to the only entrance of their neighborhood. As Brad Davis reports, county commissioners are now trying to find a solution. It looks finely timed and orchestrated. Cars pull in and cars pull out. But when it gets crowded and traffic picks up on East Lake Road, things can turn chaotic as people try and come and go from the Crescent Oaks gated community. This is the only exit and entrance to our whole community of 440 homes. It's very dangerous. Residents like Bob Luce have long sought a traffic light as a solution. And nearly five years ago, one was approved. But there was a hitch. Since Crescent Oaks is private, so is the road that dumps onto East Lake Road. That meant the Homeowners Association would have to pay the $200,000 to install and maintain the traffic light. Now, after three accidents in recent weeks, the issue is back. I am outraged by this. It's unconscionable what they're doing. Pinellas County Sheriff Bob Gualtieri spoke to county commissioners today and told them that signs are now in place to alert drivers. We want to just draw awareness uh, to uh, that intersection and just use caution. Commissioners had some ideas of their own to help the problem. One is to eliminate the opening between the north and southbound lanes on busy East Lake Road. That scenario would cause motorists to make a right-hand turn and then a U-turn. It's done all over U.S. 19. The county will now study turning patterns at the opening. What I'm hearing is we want to look at turning patterns now. The turning patterns are bad, and we went out and we, we tried to channelize this so it wouldn't be as bad, and it's still bad. County commissioners plan to hold a public meeting with the residents here from Crescent Oaks to outline their final recommendations. In Pinellas County, Brad Davis, ABC Action News.